Yo, yo, good morning. Welcome back to another video. I'm out here fishing Newport Bay. Today is Friday, July 28th. It's about 5.30 in the morning. And, uh, oh, something's blowing up over there. But we're looking for spotted bay bass today. We're gonna be fishing in an area that's about 12 to 14 feet, depending on the height of the tide. And we're looking for spotties. First fish of the morning, not a bad one. Sick, some cool spots on his tail. Pretty fish, nice fat belly. Hopefully I don't break off today because I just realized that I forgot my whole box of Warbait's heads and my whole box of PKs. <laughs> so we got the one and only neck breaker and tail spin. We also got a couple spinner baits, luckily. Jeez. Forged. They all got little bellies on them. Smoked it. Felt like a nice fish. I bet they'll still eat it with no tailspin. Of course it's biting the day I don't bring, I forget the box. Oh. <laughs> you can slug. Talk to the camera for this one. Oh yeah, dude. On the PK slug. The sick one. This tailspin, I've uh, I fished this tailspin on so many sessions and today it finally fell apart and they're still chewing the slug. We'll measure this one. He's got a belly, he's long. All right, so it's not quite a proper measurement. I got my hand in its face. I could probably get him to 15. He's real close, but that's a nice fish. Solid spotty. Fish blowing up. No. Oh, he spit one. These fish are blowing up on the surface. Spotty's 15 feet of water. Pitched out the submission fishing coast slow pitch. Hooked that thing and look what he just spit up. Later. Yeah, I'm not exactly sure what kind of bait fish that is. If you know, let me know. I'm gonna talk a little bit about how I like to fish the spinnerbait. This is the one ounce HD spinnerbait by Warbaits. So the tide's coming in right now. There's a big grass flat here with a bunch of patches of grass on it. The tide's coming in, so that means it's moving kind of towards me. The mouth is there of the harbor. 
So it's kind of moving towards me in this way. You can also tell by the angle of these moored boats. So I'm going to get a long cast. Right when it hits the water, I like to pull it to get the blades working while it's on the way down because they do eat it on the sink. I'll get it to the bottom. Oh, I'm bit. Oh, he tagged it. Pop it right off the bottom. Because if there's any blades of grass or anything like that, it'll rip through and get the blade spinning properly again. I like to keep a steady wind. A couple pauses in there. And then click it in free spool and let it hit the bottom again. Just to make sure you're down there. And then repeat. Spinnerbait eater, thanks for playing. Giant. Giant. You gotta be freaking kidding me. Giant. Proper 17 right there. That's a proper 17. Newport Bay. Out here fishing the grass. Giant spotty. Giant spotty. It's right at about 17 inches. Megalodon. It's time to put her down. and call it there that is a morning fish in Newport Bay just a couple hours fishing the grass flats and the mooring cans uh, I was probably out for about two and a half hours I'd say the most bit bait of the day was probably the one ounce HD spinner bait uh, we also had a really good bite this morning on the neck breaker quarter ounce neck breaker with the PK tailspin check out warbaits at warbaits on Instagram check out kicker fishing at kicker fishing on instagram you can find me on instagram at lane.killian thank you for watching see you in the next video if not see you out on the water